So hello guys, in this video, I'm just gonna want to show you how you can attack while moving. In this project here, uh, I have created some kind of like a player movement and some attack animation here to play. But as you can see, when, when you click the mouse button here to attack, the feet is like freezing and it doesn't look that natural. So here, how you can fix it, it's a pretty simple trick, is we are going to use what is called the animation blend layer. And this is for the Unity game engine, and in the next video, I'll, I'll be showing you how to create the same implementation for Unreal Engine 5. So yeah, let's get started. Here is my base layer animator. Here you got a movement blend here, I blend between idle and run animation, very simple. And here I also has a attack trigger, this is like a attack animation for the player. But we will disconnect this, we can delete that, delete that, delete this. And here we have to create a new uh, layer for our animation. Just click that. I will name this maybe uh, attack layer. On the gear box here, just click that. I will make the weight to be one. Uh, if the weight is zero, it will not affect the overall animation of the character. So make sure you set this to above a zero. I will set this to one. And for the mask here, we're going to create a new avatar mask. So here in your project folder here, you can right click, create and create avatar mask. I will name this maybe attack layer mask. Then click on it. Go to the inspector side here on the humanoid. This is where it gets interesting. That like you have to select which part of the player's body to be affected by this animation. So here I will just um, set the top layer of body since the attack animation is playing on the player's hand so I will just click on the bottom part of this character here to make it red it means that this part of the body will not be affected by the attack layer on the attack layer here uh, set the mask here to be attack layer mask and for this one blending I'll set this to additive Okay, on this animator, you can right click and create an uh, empty state. This is uh, this is just for an empty state. It means that nothing will happen if the attack trigger is not triggered. So here, you can drag off your attack animation. Here, make transition to this attack animation and make the transition back into the uh, empty state. I'm just gonna name this to like maybe empty state. Uh, make sure you have the empty state when you are using the blending set to additive on this transition over here uncheck the exit time and i'll set the transition duration to maybe 0 0.15 and this one you have to check the exit time so it will be automatically go back to the previous uh empty state when the animation ends and don't forget to set the condition here i have the attack trigger uh trigger on the parameters here attack trigger and this is how i set the trigger to be a uh, triggered on the player attack.cs if the mouse button left click is pressed i will just set the trigger of the uh, animator here and it will automatically play the uh, attack animation in the in the attack layer black let's try it and we can click play and we can attack while moving Okay, very good guys now it's working perfectly fine yep that's a very short tutorial of this video i hope you guys enjoy this video and don't forget to give a like and subscribe to my channel if you found this helpful and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video which i will cover uh the same implementation but on Unreal engine 5 so yeah stay tuned for more video and i'll see you guys in the next one